Welcome to AMS. Today in this video we are going to solve a question and question is 1 over a plus 1 over b equal to 1 over a plus b plus y minus 1 over y. In order to solve this question for this y, first we should take LCM individually on the both side of the equation and we will get after taking LCM on the both side of the equation individually b plus a over a b because on the left side of the equation because this b will multiply with this one plus sign will remain same this a will multiply with this one and b will get b plus a over a b and these two fraction will make a one fraction and now the other side of the equation we should do the same procedure and this y will multiply with this one and we will get y this minus will remain same and this whole value will multiply with this one and we will get a plus b plus y over a plus b plus y into y now in the next step this y will come out from the bracket and will multiply with this minus sign and we will get plus y is same as before this y will come out from the bracket and will multiply with this minus sign and this whole bracket or a plus b minus with the minus sign will remain same and on the other side of the equation we will arrange these values it b plus a over a plus b it means that this b plus a will arrange as a plus b now this plus y and this minus y will cancel out with each other and now in the next step we should get minus a plus b and this a plus b will go in division with this a b and we should get a plus b over a b into a plus b because this a, a plus b will go in division with this a b and here we get minus 1 and the other part of the equation will remain same now this a plus b and this a plus b will cancel out with each other and now in the next step we should do two things first this a plus b will multiply with this one and we should get minus a b and now this a plus b plus y will multiply with each other and will will go in multiply here or will go or will move to the other side of the equation and will multiply with this one after cancelling we get after cancelling of a plus b so here when this a plus b multiply with this y we will get a plus b into y and when this y will multiply with this y we will get y square and this whole value basically will go in cross multiplication with this one and we will get a plus b into y plus y square now in the next step we should arrange this equation as y square plus a plus b into y and this minus a b will move to the other side of the equation and convert into plus a plus b convert into plus a b sorry now we can see that this is the quadratic equation so we should compare this equation with the standard quadratic equation which is ax square plus bx plus c and we will get the value after comparing this equation from the standard equation of a b and c to apply the formula for quadratic equation or in the put the values uh, in inside the quadratic formula and to get the value of y so first we compare these equation from the standard quadratic equation and we get the value of a b first we get the value of a which is 1 because the coefficient of y is 1 now in the next step we should get the value of b because the coefficient of y is a plus b and here the c is a b because uh, the value which have no variable it will be equal to c according to standard quadratic formula now as we know that the quadratic formula is y is equals to minus b plus minus under root b square minus 4ac upon 2a so here we replace the value of a b and c from 1 a plus b and a b and we will get the value after replacing the value of a b and c minus a plus b plus minus under root a plus b square minus 4 1 into a b over 2 into a because this b will replace with a plus b this b will replace with a plus b this a will replace with 1 and this c will replace with a b and this a will replace with 1 now 
we should simplify this condition and first we should solve this uh, under root value so i uh, first i solve this uh, under root value so i or i wrote, wrote here simply the root value and nothing else so as we know that a plus b whole square minus 4 into 1 into a b is in existing inside the root and we will solve first this thing so as we know that this a plus b can be open a plus b whole square formula which is a square plus b square plus 2 a b so here we replace a plus b whole square formula with this value and we will get after replacing this value uh, from a square plus b square plus 2 a b uh, under root and this will multiply together and we will and this uh, will multiply together and it will be equal to minus 4ab now this plus 2ab and minus 4ab will simplify and we will get a square plus b square and minus 2ab because minus 4 plus 2 will be equal to minus 2 and now we can see that this will be equal to a minus b whole square formula so here we these value will replace with a minus b whole square formula now in the next step this root and this square value will cancel out with each other and a minus b will come out from the root so here we solve these root uh, this root and get the value of a we get value a minus b for this root value and now in the next step we should insert this a minus b at the place of this root value and we will get y is equal to minus a plus into a plus b will remain same plus minus will remain same but this value will replace with a minus b and over 2 will remain same so here we solved uh, y for the two values first value is y a is equal to minus into a plus b plus a plus b a minus b over 2 and the second value is y is equal to minus into a plus b minus a minus b over 2 so first we should solve this value and we will get after simplifying this value is this minus will multiply with both of these value minus a and minus b and this plus will multiply with both of these value and we will get plus a minus b over 2 will remain same now this minus a and this plus a will cancel out with each other and we will get y is equal to minus 2ab over 2 because minus b minus b will be equal to 2 now in the next step this 2 and this 2 will cancel out with each other and we will get the first value for y which is y is equal to minus b now in the next step we should simplify this condition and we will open the bracket as y is equal to minus a because this minus will multiply with both of these value and we will get minus a minus b and this minus will multiply both of these value and we will get minus a and minus minus plus and plus b and over 2 will remain same now in the next step this b uh, minus b and this plus b will cancel out with each other and we should get equal to value y equal to minus 2 o a over 2 and now both 2 will cancel out with each other and we should get the second value for a which is y is equal to minus a so here we to, here we get the two values for this equation first is y is equal to minus b and second is y is equal to minus a so both values is the solution for this expression I here the another method to solve this equation is I am representing uh, now the another way to solve this equation. Here we step same. same here we repeat the same step uh, as we have done before in the first method. The first we should simplify the both side of the equation by taking the LCM of the both side of the equation. This b will multiply with this one, and this a will multiply with this one, and we should get a b plus a over a plus b. This y will multiply with this one, and this expression will multiply with this one, and we should get y minus a plus b plus y a plus over a plus b plus y into y now we should arrange this equation as a plus b over a b and this y will come out from this bracket and will multiply with this minus and both y will cancel out with 
each other now in the next step we should get a plus b over a b and this minus a b a plus b will come out in the division with a b and the other expression a minus 1 over a plus b plus y into y will remain same now in the next step this a plus b and this a plus b will cancel out with each other and we should get a b this a b will multiply with this minus 1 and this a plus b plus y into y will multiply with this one here we get after cancelling this a plus b now in the next step we should arrange this equation as minus a b is as here this y will multiply both of these values first is a plus b into y and second one will y will multiply with this y we will get y square now here we arrange this equation as y square plus a plus b into y plus a b is equal to 0 because this minus a b will move to the other side of the equation and convert into a plus b and as we know that we have done these steps before in equation 1 now the second method will start from here to solve this equation how this is the easiest way for, as before how we should solve this equation simply we will multiply this y with both of these value and we will get y square plus a y plus b y plus a b after multiplying this y with both of these value and y square and plus a b will remain same now in the next step we should take common y from both of these value and we will get y as a common value and y plus a will be the reminder and we should take common b from both of these value and we will get b as a common value and y plus a will be the reminder now in the next step we should take common y plus a as a common value and y plus b will be the reminder after taking common y plus a from the whole expression now in the next step we should take y plus a equal to 0 and y plus b equal to 0 now this y plus a or this y plus a will uh, b equal to 0 and this plus a will move to the other side of the equation and it will convert minus a and this plus b will move to the other side of the equation and it will convert to minus b and here we get same value as before and we get two values for y for this expression first is minus a and second is minus b same as before so here we get two values y is equal to minus a and y minus y equal to minus b for this expression again by taking or by using another method i hope this video will be very useful to all of you if you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel thank you